I went to sleep and I woke up dead, but I changed my mind and I want to. I went to sleep and I woke up dead, but I changed my mind and I want to. I went to sleep and I woke up dead, but I changed my mind and I want to. I went to sleep and I woke up dead, but I changed my mind and I want to. Live my life A to Z, fill up all the vacancies, feel the vindication from the hate you get for chasing dreams. I made a league with or without any cosign Stealing third base, no coach, no go sign ah, That's why I'm feeling how I'm feeling now Music's my escape, but it's feeling even realer now Hey guys, welcome to the Jam House, it's Johnny And right now, we're gonna do a review on the exotic sniper rifle Icebreaker so the first thing you notice is the rate of fire here is a little low compared to a couple of other snipers which you can kind of spam. The impact makes up for it for sure and does a lot of damage even without all the damage upgrades. The range on this gun is pretty much perfect and you can make it even better with the upgrades. Stability is the biggest downfall of this gun as you can see it's kind of dog shit. The reload and magazine size doesn't really matter because of the no backpack perk that you get. Cannot be reloaded, regenerates ammo over time. So yeah, kind of changes the dynamic of reloading and ammo that you have with this gun which we'll go over a little bit later makes it really interesting so the first perk you have here is accurized ballistics more range and impact increased recoil you don't really want to increase recoil with this weapon more range and impact but once again increased recoil which i'm not really going to go for uh the worst thing about this gun is its stability so correcting that's probably your first option here if you want to make the gun feel more smooth and fluid so i go th for the third muzzle here which is the linear compensator more predictable recoil slight boost to range and impact and it also says more recoil but i've noticed that this one has the least amount and corrects itself the quickest uh, the next perk that we have up here is the molly gun uh, missing a shot has a chance to return ammo directly to the magazine now when you combine that perk with the no backpack perk with regenerating ammo it actually creates for uh, interesting dynamic that we'll go over in a little bit quick draw you know draw the weapon a little bit faster send it increase range and accuracy I'll probably go for that one and uh, the third perk here is snapshot so aiming this weapon is incredibly fast the other upgrade that you can get here oh well yeah the send it is what, what I'll probably go for so icebreaker here icebreakers victims spontaneously combust dealing damage to others nearby uh, so you basically do AOE to the people around the enemy that you've killed and then you have your upgrade damage perks uh, so you're gonna need 18 ascendant energy and 48 spin metal to fully upgrade this weapon okay so let's take a quick look at the gun the blinking light on the gun there actually indicates the ammo that's regening and when you zoom in you can see it up above the colored blinking lights right now it has two bullets that now it has three and it just does this until you have all your ammo and you can keep using it and it regens while you're shooting so i sped this up but this is what i find interesting here check this out So basically what happened there is I got 10 shots out of one magazine all in about 8 seconds. Now this is because of the two perks that the gun has. Remember the no backpack perk which basically just regens ammo over time which you can see happens while I'm firing. But also the mulligan perk which replaces a bullet directly into the magazine if I miss a shot. So with those combined I actually get 10 rounds in the magazine. This is incredible for PvP and PvE. Another thing that this gun does that it doesn't really say is when it regens ammo you can pretty much switch to another special weapon that you have and because you have full ammo on your icebreaker you'll have half ammo of any other gun you equipped. I'm not sure if it's supposed to be like that but you can definitely take advantage of that and pretty much have unlimited ammo for any gun in the special weapon slot. So that's pretty much the review guys, um, I highly recommend this sniper, if you don't already have it, definitely go buy it from Zer for 17 strange coins I think it is. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, don't forget to come check us out on twitch.tv slash jam underscore house. If you have any other questions, let me know in the comment section, and uh, yeah, we'll see you later.